Hello everyone, I'm the old guy and it's time to take another look at High Seas High Profits. The developer Lexi has given me access to the alpha demo and I want to supply some feedback and make some videos on this because I'm uh, very interested in this game actually. So let's get started. The first thing that I want to do is just acknowledge some of these assets here. They are looking very nice. You know, maybe a clay thing here, some lumber yard it looks like. So yes, it is coming along very nicely. There is no options for sound or anything else, although he does say that the sound is coming very quickly. So let's start a new game here. So I'm just going to leave everything the same here. Let's just start. very nice screen I like the new artwork welcome Lewis thank you for trying out the alpha demo of high seas high profits this game is being made with a lot of passion by a dude in his 30s that's not very relevant to the gameplay come to think of it at this stage of the game many mechanics are functional but a lot of them are not here are some things to keep in mind captain traits are not implemented they don't do anything pirate encounters are not implemented Automatic trading is not implemented. There is no sound soon to come. Turn-based gameplay is available for now. Real-time is planned for the future. Many tooltips are not properly linked to other existing tooltips, and some tooltips were never created. There is no events other than the starting quest. High Seas is meant to be full of them, and I promise you'll see more of that in the beta. There are no mayors or parks yet. Many businesses share a single default building model. Please consider wishlisting and telling a friend if you haven't already. There will be many bugs. Please report them in the menu. There are many, many awesome things I'd love to add to High Seas, but they will all depend on whether we manage to make the game successful together. You truly have the chance to shape the future of this game. More than anything, I wish you have fun even at this stage. Let me know how things are going and what could be improved. Lots of love, Lexi. And again, I would like to thank Lexi for giving me the opportunity to play the early demo here, the alpha demo. I am very excited for this game. It is looking really good. It is on the right track for sure. So let's get going here. Let's sail. So here is the main quest. This is the money we have. This is the population in our town. Here is it. it's Bracken Hollow is where we're at. And you can see, like he said, that some of these assets are the same. There is the, st the stone mine, clay pit, right? Wool, wool spinner. More stuff here. Brewery, dwelling more dwellings here is the trading hub we have the overview right here here is our warehouse very cool you can see that the trading is blanked out he has mentioned that there is no auto auto trading yet so that is coming in the future and we can trade with the city so here is the trading interface you can also get to it by highlighting the ship here here is our ship the first love and we can get to it from here as well then it has all the stuff by one by five and the amounts that are in the city so very cool here is the shipyard we can build ships there are a lot of different models here i am really liking the artwork by the way i am on board with the look of this and here is the map it looks great and it's all random generated so the map is different every time you kind of uh start a new game so very cool, very cool beginning here. It's looking pretty, pretty good, I think. So let's go back to our hometown and let's take a look at this one first here. Trader Lewis, welcome to our small city of Bracken Hollow. I hope you have traveled well. The citizens of Bracken Hollow are delighted to have a new trader settle in their city. As a token of their gratitude, they would like to present you with a small welcoming gift. Please choose one of their two offerings, which I shall later deliver to one of your available ships. So we have 10 bottles of wine or 20 sacks of grain. And I am truly sorry here, but I have a new kitten. I got, I have adopted a new cat. Here she is. 
This little girl's named Gigi. Mm. If you see the curtains move and everything else, she's le she's only uh, seven months old. I got her and her twin sister, so we got two of these little devils running around. Here, I'm going to put you back down. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. There's some introductions. Uh, I'm going to take the wine. And they got a little check mark here to say that the quest is done, I think. And this is the main quest line. So I already did uh, probably finish challenge number one. That's kind of the movement, moving around, going to the map, uh, looking for the trading stuff and all that. Challenge number two, let's start trading. In the trading interface, buy some goods, pick some that are plentiful and cheap. We want a profit. Okay, so let's, we have our ship highlighted. Let's go into the trading interface and let's see what is stocked up here. We have 28 logs, we have 28 lumber. There's vegetables here, 26 of those. So maybe, and they're cheap too, right? What, uh, is there anything here that's more expensive? Lumber, 28. It could be, it would be nice if I could click on this to see what uh, Bracken Hollow specializes in. Can we look at it in here? Production. So it produces cloth, it looks like. It produces grain. Does it produce anything else? An ale. Ale, clay, cloth, and grain it produces this town so let's look back on trading with the city here ale is at 17 not great clay 15 with cloth as well 24 cloth maybe do this one let's buy some cloth here and you can see when i click on it it goes into our hold here 19 let's do let's just buy some of this stuff here 55 and what else here this one there we are full up now so now the next part is open the world map and travel to a neighboring city so let's open up the world map here and travel to a neighboring city. Let's go to Stoneshire. If we right click, we can do this. And this is a turn-based game. He said that the uh, real time is coming later, which is okay. And now Stoneshire here, bonuses on fish, salt, stone, own the zero businesses that we do here. So let's click another round here. You can't click anywhere else except for the towns at the moment. So I wonder if he's going to add that. And I guess there's going to be pirate battle. So I guess you're going to have to be able to do that and hopefully add some kind of, you know, interesting things in the water, maybe some storms and all that would be cool. Wait for your ship to reach the new city, then left click that city on the world map to enter it. All right. So let's continue here We go another t turn. You can see all the other uh, NPC traders around. Very cool. Very cool. I like it and then let's go in here and the trading hub is right here again we can go this route or, or we can go up here for quicker and let's see if we can sell anything here is the average price that we have paid and we can make some money here let's sell five of these and we can make a lot of money here as well. Let's click on logs, gone. This is not too bad neither. Let's do this and 25 vegetables, boom. We are making money. Now let's take a look at what, what does this specialize in here? Overview or wait, production. This one makes beef and fish grain salt and stone okay so let's go this way and let's see here what is stocked up fish looks pretty good let's get five fish maybe a lumber 
we've just sold the lumber or 25 let's do a thing of ore as well honey let's go with five honey as well and I don't think I'm gonna buy anything else here although we have a little bit of cargo space left and I think that this is the ship's durability yeah this is its hit points 94 and we can go in here for the ship's crew as well you can replace him the captain's log here and upgrades you can upgrade your ship I'm not exactly sure how to do that so a lot of cool stuff in development here it's gonna be nice when they get all the assets in here and hopefully he fleshes all of this stuff out but the beginnings here look really nice you know I do like the graphics a lot I mean I'm on board with that so let's go to another town actually let's look at here what we need to do challenge number three we need to make 6,000 coins next we are not quite there oh I just did another turn that wasn't the smartest now let's go to Stormcaster. I like it. It's Stormshire and Stormcaster. Very nice. This is all procedurally generated again. All right. Let's go into here. Hopefully, we can sell some fish. No, we cannot sell fish here. That. This might not be a good price at all. all of this stuff is not very good although it's on the same island maybe they have they're making a relatively the same thing maybe stone here 24 salt let's buy let's buy five salt here let's do that we're not going to sell anything and let's go back what is this here build in the city so we can build stuff look at all the stuff that we can build holy cow that's quite a bit bonuses oh I see raw processed oh nice ships oh he sorted it all out that's cool I like that I like that a lot there's a lot of good ideas in here so let's go down to moral gate moral gate and we cannot click next because there is a quest here that needs to be looked at and I think this is the taxes dear Lewis the following taxes have been paid for the previous four weeks so we have sailors wages of 80 coins so yes taxes and now that it's uh been looked at and taken care of we can progress the turn and then disappears here let's go in and hopefully we can make some sales here even worse oh look at this bam that's not very good here this is pretty good salt boom maybe we can buy some of this let's oh did I sell it I just sold it ouch not good not good hmm is there anything here that we can sell 32 or right five let's do another one here at 38 that's a whole lot better I'm probably wasting money as usual is this one here not available this feature will be available in the thing and not available deselect ship very nice and this one here is the ship's convoy all right let's sail down to thornwick here this time for these here oh i think that's where we're headed yeah, then it puts another one here. Yeah. And let's go in here and do some trading. Here we go. Let's sell that. Let's sell this. 
sell that beautiful 5,000. We're almost there. Let's buy some more salt here. This might be pretty good. Let's buy five salt vegetables here. Let's do this. Anything else that we can do that'd be all right? Clay, maybe? No, clay's at 15. Bricks, maybe? Nothing's jumping out at me here, so let's continue on. Silvermere. Only got a bonus in vegetables here. One of these guys, pottery and stone. I might buy some more vegetables over here. And we have another tax bill. Yes, another 80. Let's go in here and start to trade again. Nope. Oh, look at this. Let's buy more. Oh, I just sold it. I keep doing that. Let's go this. 15, 17... Yeah, we're going to save that. Is there anything else? Oh, look at logs here. And clay. Can't do clay. Let's do this. One. Two. Three. And there we go. We are full up. All right, let's go to here. Embersteed. And can we sell anything here now? Yes, we can sell this. Ooh, vegetables are even cheaper here. Bam. Oh, I just sold it again. Ugh. Let's go one more here. Let's do that. What else can we sell here? Or buy, I should say. Vegetables are still pretty good. Let's go with that for now. That is quite the trip. What is it going? That's quite a distance away. Let's go back to... Let's go to Iron Haven. And we have another tax bill. The price of doing business. Let's go in here and do some trading, hopefully. How come I cannot sell this? Boy, let's buy some of this. There we go. I wonder why I can't sell this. Oh, I see, because it's not five, there's four of them. Let's sell. Bam, there we go. Very nice. And honey here, let's buy some honey. So let's buy some cloth here. And one honey, let's do that. And let's go up to Oakenshire. And boom, let's do this again. And that's pretty good. Let's sell this. Honey, that's not bad. And this for, let's buy another salt. 
They got anything else here? Logs. And we're full up again. Let's go back to the menu and go up here. And we've got another tax bill here. Price of doing business. And trading. Oh yeah, look at that. Bam. This is pretty good. This is good too. Perfect. Four for 33. We're at 45. What else can we buy? Look at this. Bricks. Let's do some bricks. Anything else? Tar. Fifty-nine. Cool. So things way different and all that. That's very nice. Let's go to Blackwater. And one more turn here. Goes into port. Boom. sell this there's some nice profit there this is pretty good sell that too we can sell this to double the price we are at six thousand there we got it build a new ship go to your hometown shipyard and build a new ship you may need to bring in materials from other cities Okay, so let's go into here and let's go to our hometown, which is right here and there. And we're going to build total cost. This one, is there one that's a, a 10,000? Look at that. Let's build, let's build the cheap one here, I think. We're going to have to buy this and cargo capacity of 60 it's the same one as the same ship that we have let's build this in four weeks eight turns and we are down to four thousand and then let's actually bring our ship back here i'm not sure how to make a convoy okay we have the first love already highlighted let's bring it back let's stop in Let's stop and go up to these towns here and see before we go, just to be efficient. And we have a tax bill. Price of doing business. And let's take a look here. Now let's sell this, not bad, 34. Well, we can buy more salt. We just sold it. We can buy cloth here, though. Let's buy that. And let's buy some clay. Some lumber. Some vegetables. There we go. And let's go up here. got oh that's not bad not bad not bad eh, could be better but we'll take it beef fish stone and salt Ooh, wooden tools Two wooden tools. There we go. Oh, I messed up. 
let's go back home. Now, I think it's been over eight turns, and we do have a ship in here. I hope that there is some sort of message telling you that the ship has appeared. If I haven't seen it, oh, maybe there is one here. Yes, the shipyard. It's been done. Okay, there is a message. It's right there, so pardon me. And I will conquer the seas. And now, can I, this and, how do we form a convoy? Add a ship to the convoy. Make a new convoy. The first love. Oh, he's a drunkard, look at this. Cool. Remove ship, promote ship, rename ship. And add the whispering wind to it bam we have a convoy replace a captain in the crew tab of one of your ships replace the existing captain with a new one all right so there was a drunkard in here i think that's the sea serpent i want the the first love let's take a look at the captain he's a drunkard we're gonna fire him replace are you sure you want to place this captain? Replace. And we have a gambler. Not much better in my terms, but we'll take him. And that's the price of doing business. And now we are on challenge four, setting up shops. We are going to start building buildings, but we're going to do that in the next episode. So, so far, I want to give a little bit of feedback on what I've seen so far. And it is, you know, I hope that we can just sail around wherever we want instead of just going straight to the town would be nice. Um, of course, the assets in the town, I know that th that is coming for sure. We've seen them in the title screen and they look great. So hopefully those come in. Uh, some sound would be good. And I don't know, maybe some, you know, random effects here, a storm or something. So... I'm going to dive more into this game. I am enjoying it so far. I do like it, and there's a lot of good ideas happening here. Anyways, let me know what you think about this in the comments below. Thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you soon. Bye.